Hi, everybody. I wanted to spring this one to you from Fox 47 News. Now grab the cool blasts off the table and Hang take on. one. Now! This is kind of pissing me off here. One second, folks. Gotta figure out why this one was making noise. No. No. Okay. Well, anyways. So, plague has been discovered uh, in Michigan by Fox. 47 news. I'm not sure why it's Fox 47 because the local Fox channel is not that, so this must be up north or in some other area. Anyways, this is the story here, folks. A Michigan resident has been diagnosed with a case of bubonic plague, according to Michigan Department of Health and Human Research or Human Services. A uh, plague victim returned from a visit from Colorado. The individual is a Marquette County resident. Public health officials say there's no concern regarding human-to-human -human transmission in this case. This is Michigan's first plague diagnosis and the 14th case reported nationally in 2015. Uh, plague is life-threatening flea-borne illness that is r very rare and it occurs among wild rodents in western United States. Um, I won't go into major things because it doesn't have a whole lot of really good info. But this year, 14 human cases uh, have been there, including four deaths, have been reported. Uh, the reason for the increase is not well known. So this is the major thing I'm going to say on this. It's a flea-based uh, disease found to exist in rodents, among other things. Um, and, you know, we, we've all seen the... Totally new, cool, new, I drink is cool serious? Cool that! Wow, that just randomly happens. I'm so surprised. Anyways, so this is random. And, I'm oh, sorry, I'm playing from the other video. Anyway, so there has been a case of plague in uh, Michigan. It is the, I think they said, 15th case in uh, the United States for 2015. They don't know why there's an increase. And there has been three deaths, I believe, nationally from plague. Again, I don't know who they are. Could have been scientists for all we know. <laughs> Sorry, I know I've been saying I'm going to cut out the sneezes and stuff, but every once in a while you're going to probably get a video of me sneezing. I apologize. Thank you.